All right. Who are we going to talk to next? I think we need to talk to the Iron Lady, Mindy May. Mindy May, are you on the uh, on the call with us? Can you say something I so am. we can see you? I ah, am here. Okay. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm good. Are you, How are you? Are you staying isolated? Um. Yes, I am. Yeah. Okay. Good. I'm glad you're staying isolated. So. As much as possible. Uh, Mindy, I have a I have another photo that I want to show. Um, this photo actually has an egg involved, and so I think this photo is excellent. Um, but I need you to give some context here to what's happening with an egg in your hair on the chapel yeah. stage. What's going on there? That was at live at ten um, several years ago. Um, it was like egg roulette or something like that. Um, yeah, so Brooke and I had to pick which eggs were raw and which ones weren't. And so it was just kind of a chance. So whoever got the wrong egg, clearly it busted all over their face. So, so you, you got the raw end of that deal? Is that what happened? Or maybe you didn't you know, get your the jokes raw. are continuing to shine. That's so good. <laughs> They're dad jokes. That's all I have. <laughs> all right. So Mindy, you work with our students here. You serve alongside of our students. Um, what can you tell us about how our students are doing or thriving? What are you seeing? It's a hard time. It's difficult. What's what's going on? Yeah. Well, first of all, just with our students, one of the things that I have loved seeing um, is just their continued resiliency and just ability to adapt really well. Um, they've all just done a phenomenal job um, just transitioning and being so gracious and patient um, with all of us through the process. So thank you guys for that. Truly, that's amazing. Um, and just their their trust in the Lord has been phenomenal to see. Um, I've heard from several, you know, who are struggling in some different ways. So it's been fun to stay connected. Um, but then also just students who um, we had CU lead kickstart last night with the RAs for next year. And it was just really sweet just to get to see them connect, sign contracts and just prepare for the future as well. So I think overall they're doing well, but it's just a strange season. But yeah, pressing into the Lord, staying in chapel. Yeah, so I understand our, our RAs, RDs, they're actually reaching out and still keeping small group discipleship and keeping contact going. How is that happening? What are they doing? How is that working? Yeah, most of that's just being done through Zoom. A lot of them still have their hall or unit meetings going on. Um, so that's real, really fun. The RAs are still having their one-on-ones with their RDs. So just trying to keep as much as that Cedarville community um, that is always our focus, just done today, just digitally. So. All right. So, Mindy, what's one of your best memories of the last four years or so with this group of students? Oh, goodness. That's hard to pick just one. I honestly love a leave. So any Aleve is, is probably a favorite memory. Um, one of the things I get to do with Aleve that most people don't know is I get to work with um, the people doing the wardrobes and the costumes and going to dress rehearsal. And those are some of my favorite memories of just getting to work with the students as they prepare for such a big event is really fun for me um, just to get to do a little bit of behind the scenes stuff with that because those are just times we get to come together and just have fun. That's and awesome. I love it. That's yeah. awesome. Well, Mindy, thanks for joining today. I appreciate you and all of sure. your ministry to our students through residence life and counseling and everything else that you do. So thanks for your Thank service. You. Thanks. All right, um, here's another prayer.